what's up everybody? We wanted to uh, shoot a quick video. This is clutch number 19. Um, we posted pictures with some of the animals on Facebook um, and it obviously got uh, a lot of attention. These animals are pretty extraordinary so I, I definitely wanted to do a video and um, share some of the background on these animals and talk about some of the genetics which are pretty complex. So this is the side, uh, this is the dame, sorry, female. This is a high intensity, orange dream, fire clown, female, uh, 2017 female. And I'm gonna post a picture of the male cause he's in shed right now. But the male that bred this girl, um, we have it labeled as a super orange dream, yellow belly, black pastel, cypress, Head clown. Now that guy came from a mix. Uh, Who's your daddy? Uh, pairing. So there is a possibility that he may be leopard as well. I'm just not sure. Um, we'll take a look at his first clutch. This is his first clutch that he produced, um, and we bred him to some other females. So we should get more clutches. At that point, we should have more information. Um, but I want to share this clutch with you. It's a, it's a pretty crazy uh, group of animals. It was a small clutch, five egg clutch. And here they are. Just a tub of absolute beauty. So the first one here, um, these animals are pretty unique in appearance. Um, this one's head has me going back and forth whether or not it has cypress in it um, or not, but I have this labeled as a super orange dream clown. Um, and again, these are, these are theoretical IDs. This animal here is labeled as a super OD yellow belly. See the belly, see the yellow belly coming in. Let's compare it to this guy. It's a little more black. This one has a little more yellow tinge to it. And this female is trying to escape. All right. And of course, uh, let me put this girl away. Can you pause? Me? Okay, we had to put Mama away. She was getting a little crazy. But, um, and then this one here, um, it's really, really cool. This this looks very similar to the sire um, and a sibling to the sire. But you see that super reduced side pattern? Let's put the lid on these guys. Super reduced side pattern on this snake, um, indicative of yellow belly, um, and the really, really light head, it's lighter than usual, um, makes me think that there's fire in here. So I labeled this girl as orange dream yellow belly fire, and of course she is black pastel, uh, which happens to be a Barnhart line black pastel, as well as cypress. Um, absolutely gorgeous and obviously she's 100% head clown um, but a really really beautiful animal and this animal is actually on morph market right now we we'll put this one up for sale um, if she sells she sells if she doesn't I wouldn't be terribly upset um, I could just get creative and put some uh, other unique uh, clown males on this one maybe even that bongo that we just picked up that bongo motley but uh yeah very very cool all right now the last two are my favorites uh, i think everybody's favorite start with this guy here or this girl so this animal this animal is just absolutely gorgeous um i love the super dark uh dorsal that nice chocolate coloring um this thing just Kind of reminds me of a s'mores. Just so beautiful. And look at the side pattern. So this animal here, I have labeled as a, a super orange dream, black pastel, 
cypress yellow belly. That's my theoretical idea on this one. Um, beautiful girl, just absolutely gorgeous. Um, really, really excited to raise this one up and uh, get creative with, with the next pairing. Now, the last one is my favorite, but this one just has me completely flabbergasted because looking looking at the other black pastel cypress in the litter, they have that reduced pattern head. I mean, no pattern, zero pattern head, I mean. Like if you look at these, look at the head pattern. It's just completely wiped out from the black pastel and the cypress. So this animal, theoretical ID right now that I have on it is, it's definitely super orange dream definitely yellow belly and fire and uh it looks to be black pastel as well um and i'm assuming cypress um uh, but looking at the reduced pattern the side pattern the white belly just man this thing just blows me away so the only difference if my identification is correct the only difference between this animal and this animal would be fire which doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me um, I'm thinking this animal with fire would simply be lighter, but would still have that same color palette and pattern. So just being upfront, 100% honest. Um, that's why I wanted to explain the genetics to you guys. This ID is tentative. Um, this animal could be uh, super orange dream, yellow belly fire, black pastel, potentially leopard. If if those the sire is carrying leopard, um, or it could be something else entirely, or it could be exactly what we think it is: super orange dream, yellow belly fire, black pastel, and cypress. Maybe that added gene just creates this really bizarre appearance. Now I bred that same male to two additional fire females. One being a super orange dream fire and the other one being a straight fire clown. Super Orange Dream Fire Clown and a fire clown. So those eggs are cooking, so we'll have more information here soon. But what a phenomenal project. Um, just the colors and the pattern, just insane. Never produced anything like this. So, all right, guys, I hope you guys found this informative. Um, I hope this excites you guys as much as it excites me. And um, I know these are some of Robbie's favorites too. Um, so we're pretty pumped to continue working with these genes and these projects um, and just taking these, these combos to the next level, man. All right, I'm out.